Okay, finally. This is Salamancer. You are watching Sal TV, and I've been a little upset at the uh, the recent update because it did break a lot of STV demos, which is kind of lame. But I do finally have some games for you now that new games are being played, and the STV demos after the update do seem to work. Watching Team Effort versus IDK Denmark today in Division 2, Week 4 of ETF2L. So we're going to have two maps. It's going to be Granary and obscure and right now we're looking at a kind of a weird rollout there from our red demo from team effort he, he may have missed one of his jumps so uh upper rollout from the blue demo though and look at all the damage coming in immediately idk doing some very good kills here uh looks like the medic is under pressure but some good surfing there from i believe that is meek yes from idk um good surfing from him does manage to save himself can gompy get the skill on the demo no he cannot actually mads is still alive just barely being kept up there by the medic and that's a very good mid fight win for idk denmark and yes, I know that the HUD is slightly broken. Uh, I've not had the opportunity to fix it because I'm, I may have been playing some Battlefield 3 today. It's, uh, it was a pretty fun game. I'm looking at streaming it too, but I haven't tried yet. Anyway, um, we do have IDK now pushing into the second point. And mm, yeah, they're going to have some difficulty there because we are getting spam coming in from our red team. Demo Man is ready to go with that uh, right now. I'm, my camera feels weird. I don't know why it feels so weird, but it just, it, I don't know. Maybe I'm just not used to it because I'm playing Battlefield all day. Wow, nice! Okay, nice Uber. The soldier actually jumped over that sticky trap, so he completely missed it, but the, the Uber does pop anyway. They are forcing right here over onto Team Effort. What they need to do is start doing some big damage here, though, and if they can't, then that, that could be really, really detrimental for their efforts to push into Team Effort. Uh, but, yeah, there you go. It looks like the Medic Demo combo pushing a little too far forward there. Our Demo does get F air shot. I'm sorry. That's QNX. Got air shot by Dusty. And now Helberg already on the point, just trying to pressure in. Oh, yeah, he's forced everybody to go stand on that point. So now, very good round win and medic quite a quick one for idk denmark bringing it to 1-0 here in div 2 um you don't often see games that quick on granary unless i mean unless there's a unless there's a severe loss from the mid fight you know you, you lose a mid fight you lose your medic theirs stays up that's the only time you're going to see around that fast unless it's like at the you know div 3 or below but let's see, QNX does take the normal left-hand side rollout now, and once again, he did predict accurately that Mads was going to be on the, the upper rollout, but Mads is not taken. oh, actually, Mads is about 30 health, if he drops down, he's going to have to be really careful, um, Red now taking a very aggressive rollout here, but did get pilled, Mads still doing a really good job of keeping his health up, and there you go, Medic does pick him up, so now he's going to be okay for now, no, he gets taken down immediately, uh, Johnny Jackal here, though, looks like he's getting killed by a Dusty, so Dusty doing some big work here, and there goes most of team effort, once again, they're getting wiped out here, it's just a scout left for efforts, and he may get a kill on BC here, if he can, uh, no, he is wiped out there, so everybody for team effort taken down, they're going to leave BC back here, while, uh, and Dusty actually as well, who is, who else is left, no, it's just the two of them, so they're just going to cap uh, cap middle point and they're going to wait to push on to the second until they've got their medic back up with them. I think they may be giving team effort here enough time to push out into their yard if they're not careful. Where is team effort right now though? No, they're just now getting here. They're going to not try to contest that yard which may prove costly. No, there they go. They are trying to push out in the yard now just seeing if they can peek out here because really that's what you want to do. If you can hold yard and use these two tiny little choke points it's much better than trying to hold on to that second point so I'm glad they've decided to do that. IDK now going to try to push in through there. They do not have an uber advantage, and so Team Efforts Daniel is just hanging out back here with his roaming soldier. Looks like this is a pretty standard American style to play, too. Have both the scouts and the roaming soldier on one side, and then have your uh, your core demo soldier, you know, both being kind of a pocket for your medic on the other side. And that demo, of course, needs to be laying lots and lots of stickies all over the place. Right now, actually, getting a little bit forward here, didn't take a lot of damage, and actually, Azure Red Azurid, I don't know, does get taken out. He is the first casualty. They're trying to pop the Uber there for team effort. They finally have. But, oh, our blue team is going to be in such trouble here. Yeah, they're losing three players right now. And Rudy, already back on the back cap, manages to get a kill on Beastie as well. Mads has gone down. And so now it's Rudy's just chasing down the medic. Gets that kill. Meek, your needles were not enough. And looks like team effort are going to be able to capture the middle point for the first time this game. And it looks like oh QNX actually finds a soldier here trying to take him out. A nice little uh, nice little shot there by him. I, I'm not sure if he got the air shot, but he did manage to completely avoid taking any damage from that soldier, which is pretty nicely done. Looks like they are kind of waiting for somebody who may have spawned in there, but that's not going to happen. And now Team Effort with a big Uber advantage going to be pushing into last. They have to watch out for Heiberg or Helberg. I keep calling him Helberg, but somebody made fun of me for that. But they're going to have to watch out for him on the sniper. They may not realize, of course, that they're running a sniper, but you got to be prepared for everything. And actually, there's an engineer as well, Beastie, running the engineer. So we are going to see probably at least a level 2 sentry 
Ah, uh, Dusty just... Oh, uh, uh, look, look, down there. They're opening the door. They're opening the door, Hayberg. There you go. Finally, he does check down, and the Uber is flashed, though, so now he's in big trouble. Probably going to get taken out there, yes. And uh, with the Uber just fading, this, they've only gotten one kill, but they have taken out the sentry now, and I think that IDK Denmark is going to be in a world of hurt here. Team effort pushing further and further towards the point. There's only three players left up for IDK, and they do not have a medic, so there you go. Team effort, bring it up. One to one versus IDK Denmark in what looks to be a pretty evenly matched game. Let's get the yeah. There we go. The Mads roll out because uh, apparently he is Mads, bro. Uh, that was so bad. I'm just gonna quit shoutcasting after this. It's I, I'm done. I'm just done. Uh, Mads is getting out to the middle point though and taking that high ground roll out for the third time in a row which looks like he hasn't been predicted yet. So uh, his opponent may have actually tried to do the same thing. Well, Scout going up there anyway. Yes, they have both taken that high ground rollout. Um, Gompy, meanwhile, getting on top here of the crates, and he's just going to try to deal some damage from the top. First casualty there is Rudy, but there goes Mads. Nice kill by him. And now Team Effort trying to keep their medic alive, but man, both soldiers there going down very, very quickly. Um, and then the demo man for Team Effort dies as well. It's just uh, Helberg and his medic against... Oh, Gompy and... Um, who is that Scout? That is Daniel. I can't even see because they all, all they say on my screen is team effort. But uh, that is Daniel there, and he is having to back way away. So it looks like, once again, team effort lose the mid-fight there. In fact, they've lost all three mid-fights so far. It's just they did manage to uh, to bring it back. Let's see whether they can do that again because they... What in the heck was that? Oh, that sound was actually uh, Origin and Battlefield and stuff. So I think somebody may have like accepted a friend request or something. I don't know. Anyway, uh, IDK is pushing down through the garage right now. Here comes a scout. A very, very poor positioning there by Rudy get to get him taken out. So now it is six versus five. 100% Uber for team effort. I'm sorry, for IDK. And IDK there does manage to get the kill on Daniel. I need to stop that sound from happening. One second. So that should definitely fix the origin sounds. Anyway, IDK Denmark pushing into the second point, and we have team effort uh, not able to defend it. They are trying to deal some spam here. Could get a kill, actually. Helberg is down right now, and they do force the Uber. Almost everybody for IDK dying there. We're going to have to flash that Uber quite a lot, and it's going to go down very, very quickly. Now the counter Uber coming in for team effort, but they're going to have to deal with sort of a backup attempt here just by the soldier and medic right now, and Meek is going to have to drop back. Oh, Meek is taken down as well by QNX. QNX with a very good kill behind enemy lines there. So really, I kind of, you know, I like the thinking there by IDK to say, hey, if, if they're going to push it on the right, let's just push them on the left. But kind of poorly executed there. And now Dusty apparently rage quitting. No, just kidding. He probably crashed because, you know, it's Crash Fortress 2 right now. But um, that is not going to be good for IDK's chances of stopping this cap. Actually, one soldier bombing in and does get the kill on Brass Monkey. Uh, and that is going to be the medic down. So very well done by Azured to get that kill because now Meek is going to have the uber advantage, and there's just practically no way that our, our red team can really push into here. Scout sneaking in to grab that health kit there. There was no sticky trap, so he's going to be okay with that. And now Dusty has just rejoined, so got to fix that up. And we're going to watch whether IDK manages to push with their uber advantage again, which I think they should do as soon as they have it, but we will see. I mean, this is, this is the kind of thing where because it's not prem and it's we're not watching team epsilon you can never quite tell whether they're actually going to push with their advantage or not they know they have one i mean they really do know that they have the advantage and uh and i'm sure that they are just screaming their danish lungs off like let's let's push forward we're gonna have the uber advantage but let's see whether they actually do that uh and it looks like they are getting or they're thinking about it anyway is red coming up there now but the 100 percent uber is there they they really need to have already pushed forward um because they're just giving team effort time to get more uber points on the clock um, taking a bit of damage here too but they have managed to conquer the yard so far and they're actually getting a little bit of capture time down on that point so now we've got yeah team effort once again backing up towards their door they got the charge up though they popped the, the blue charge first so once again we have idk um, having to back away from the red uber and oh this could be really bad for them they're taking a lot of hits here now the ubers are finally faded though and team effort loses their demo man very quickly um it looks like Azurite has gone down as well, though. And Meek here having a dodge from an enemy scout. He's got, like, 20 health left. Uh, scout did get away from him for now, but I think the rest of his team here is probably... Oh, there goes the soldier. Demo being so aggressive right now. He's going to get jumped. His medic gets jumped as well, and there you go. Mads, really, they probably wanted to drop back to middle point there um, because that was disastrous for them, so... Anyway, here comes team effort right now. Gompy pushing forward to help secure the middle point, and nice rocket jump to get him all the way across those crates there. 
Let's see whether they can actually manage to stop this. A soldier just walks straight through. Should have been watching that. Not sure why he wasn't, but now the soldier's taking a lot of damage. 23 health left on Azure Red. He's having to drop back to the medic, and there's an uber advantage for team effort. Oh, good try to get that medic with the sniper, but I don't think he managed to hit that. Instead, probably hit something else. Johnny Jackal trying to chase him down now, but yeah, uh, it looks like team effort should push forward with their uber. It's just where are they right now? Not pushing garage. Not pushing left. Okay, they are pushing left now, so <laughs> ignore everything that I say. The soldiers, though, immediately jumping over, as is the demo, actually. And there you go, they immediately get that shotgun kill on Mads. Azured is still dead here. In fact, um, he just now died, so Mads caught a, a quicker respawn wave than him. Rudy pushing forward and trying to pressure into the medic. Meanwhile, there's a soldier trying to do a little bit of damage on the right side, but it's not going to be enough, and he does have to fall back, keep that medic alive. Nick, I'm sorry, Meek, <laughs> does have his 100% uh, uber. But he does not want to have to pop it early. And right now he's got about 75 health. So this is going to be really bad for them. Let's see if we can't find a good camera. And here you go. Final control point being contested. And there's nobody who can get on it. There you go. They finally do manage to pop that Uber on it and get some damage there from the Stickies. So Mad's got a kill on, on uh, Johnny Jackal, uh, the soldier who is back capping there. But... They did manage to force that Uber and really put uh, IDK Denmark into a very tough situation because now team effort, look at this, 85% Uber. They've almost got everybody up, so they're just going to wait for Johnny Jackal to respawn, which he has done now. And we are going to see, oh, actually IDK sneaks a scout in there, tries to go for a pick, and then he runs away. It's kind of what you want to do. Um, can't get the pick, just run back. So, of course, don't watch that bonus video of me playing Scout because that's not what I do at all. Uh, good attempt at a headshot there, but all he did was push that Demo Man back a little bit. Now, uh, getting pressured into the house. Mick is down, and there you go. That is the second capture for Team Effort. What a round there, too, for Effort because they were backed all the way up to their last point and managed to defend it very, very well. I, really, it was... Uh, it was in good part it was the mistakes made by IDK there and team effort just capitalized on them so well they just they surrounded them they said okay no if they're pushing into the right side then we have got this man we got this and so we're going to watch this mads roll out once again to see whether our blue team can manage to get the damage right now mads just throwing the stickies over at the enemy health kit so that in case the demo man decides to grab it he's in for a surprise uh, so far nobody touching it though and team effort here is Backed really up onto the left side of these crates. You're going to have to be careful. They've lost their demo man. They've lost uh, practically nobody else here. But Scout is in on the medic right now, dealing a lot of damage. Not taking him out. No, he did take him out now. But that is actually a complete wipe for IDK. So, um... Too bad that Effort could not defend their medic there successfully. They were too busy fragging the rest of the IDK team, though. So they are going to capture mid, and they're probably going to be sending somebody on to second. Yep, both the scouts already there with their uh, their cute little pumpkin heads, which you can get, actually. Uh, probably tradable. But you can also get them by killing the... Um, oh, what's the guy's name? It is the, the horseless, headless horseman. Uh, you kill him, and you get the pumpkin head. I believe that's how it works. It only works during Halloween updates, too, so you can't wear that hat just any time. Oh, team effort pushing through the doors here, or at least setting up on the doors for the second point. They want to cap last and bring this to a 3-1 to one game here. Meanwhile, IDK wants to sit on their last and just uh, defend as long as they need to until effort makes a move and makes a mistake. That's kind of what they're waiting for. Helberg on the sniper once again. And he is peeking at that right-hand door, which is also a sticky trap, but the sticky is kind of in a weird position there. They're not really going to catch anything because normally you just uber right through that door anyway. Um, oh, he does see the man. Oh, can't! cannot pick him off. Uh, that medic was actually very exposed there. Probably didn't even realize it. Look, sounds like he's uh, somebody's running a crits. Yes, team effort running the crits krieg. BC's in on that medic right now, but he gets taken down, and it looks like this crits krieg could pay off here. They have not managed to kill a sniper, though, and sniper actually being ubered for the moment. Soldier gets popped up in the air there, and really that uber should have been flashed to the soldier, but it was too late. Uh, now Helberg is the only one left to try and stop this cap, and team effort, team effort is trying to talk over me right now, but they managed to bring it to three to one. So IDK Denmark here needs to uh, to get something together. Let's see if we can't find uh, let's find a soldier. We'll watch Gompy. Watch how Gompy gomps his rollout. About 16 minutes left, as you can see down there at the bottom, and we're gonna see whether IDK can bring this back. Um, so far, Gompy doing a pretty good job there of score. So is actually the rest of his team. They're very, very, very close to each other in score. Meanwhile, Mads and Dusty pretty far down on the list. I'm kind of surprised by that because I've seen Mads play and he's not a bad demo man, but... Oh, big soldier jump here! And immediately kills the medic, but Gompy is going to be okay. A calling for the medic who is already dead. Just adding insults to injury there. But Gompy is going to be okay for a while, and it sounds like IDK's lost their medic as well. In fact, they've all been taken out. So Gompy um, pretty much just let his demo man do the do all the work there. QNX just gave himself a lot of points during that mid fight. One, it's 
very handily for Team Effort. So once again, Team Effort is on the warpath towards the second point. Alright, QNX does manage to finish off the capture there. And now it is IDK's game to lose here. They really need to put together a bit more coordination than they have been. They need to be getting more frags as well. Um, it's, you know, that, that calling's got to be there, but then so does the individual skill. And right now, it seems like there's just a little bit of a combination of both. The team effort has a bit better. Um, and is this Helberg once again on the sniper? Yeah, he probably didn't even need to be on that sniper right now. BC waiting at the drop down. It looks like uh, somebody just threw some sickies up there sort of as a as a precautionary measure because now BC actually could beast onto the enemy team here if he wants to. Um, he sort of misses opportunity there, I think. But we'll see. The Uber is already popped for team effort. They are pushing in, and they finally forced the Uber for IDK Denmark. BC does get in there behind, but doesn't manage to do a lot of damage. However, now there is an invincible soldier going to stop the capture on this point for the moment. He's got a soldier coming in on top of him here, and now, oh, scout on him as well. Good kill by Meek. He gets one, but cannot get two against two soldiers remaining. Nonetheless, team effort losing a lot of players here. It's just medic and soldier left against, um, well, against soldier and scout. So it's going to be difficult for them to run with. But that, you know, that soldier with 300 health right now, who is, um, I believe, that was Gompy, is going to be very, very formidable for them to take out. So no, IDK cannot push in and just take him out. Um, and now, yeah, Gompy here going to help build that Uber up as quickly as possible. It's going to be a big Uber advantage for team effort. So uh, IDK is going to have a lot of trouble uh, playing on... Yeah, they're going to have a lot of trouble defending their last point and outplaying Red because right now Red has the Uber. All they have to do is get a couple frags on this and they win. IDK launching some stickies down Mads, uh, trying to get some kills very, very quickly. Good kill by Helberg as well to knock out that scout. Team Effort has lost two players so far, but uh, three down for IDK and Johnny Jackal here trying to finish off this uh, demo man. He does just that with the shotgun. Looks like there's only one soldier and scout left up, and they have very low health right now. It's just going to take one tiny little rocket or shotgun shell to finish off. Oh, wow. Dusty actually jumping there with, like, 14 health left. BC's going to try to stop this. Can he do it? There we go. He does manage to stop the soldier. Can he stop the scout as well? Yes, he can. And it looks like he's getting the heals now. So very clutch respawn wave. It just took team effort too long. They couldn't get the capture, and they couldn't get the kills fast enough. So it took them way too long there to get the kills. And now IDK has managed to push back. Very good spam into the Z hallway here to stop anybody from pushing in. Uh, so it looks like a soldier wants to get out here in the face of a scout. Scout does get taken down. BC is now dead. So IDK, I, I'm not sure if I agree with his push decision. And there you go. Meek getting taken down immediately. They were not watching their flanks, so that is going to be bad for them. Uh, Daniel does die to Azured, but not before he gets that all-important medic pick. And on gravel, I mean, I'm sorry, granary here. The medic is one of the most important classes. You just if you if you keep your medic alive and you've got those uber pushes, you are almost certainly going to win if you can kill the enemy medic, which is what team effort has been doing time and time again. So IDK here, what are they gonna do? You tell me. Because I'm, I'm like I said, I'm done shoutcasting. I make terrible jokes and they're just awful. So I'm I'm you, it's up to you, man. This, this is a choose your own shoutcast now. Uh, anyway, no, IDK is gonna have to stay back inside their second point. They can't take yard. A nice little sticky, sticky trap there, but uh, not managing to kill anybody. D Mads does manage to take out Brass Monkey though. Sounds like he dropped Uber as well. A little fizzles there, giving me that indication. So uh, Meek is going to push his team forward. And I think they could have this defense. BC did die there, but there's only three players left for team effort. QNX with two health left. He's got to drop back to a health kit. He's got his scouts defending him right now. And yeah, everybody's having to fall back here. He's, he really wants to start setting up, yeah, those sticky traps right there. And already getting pressured away from that door. Um, this is not going to be good for team effort. Although they've got a lot of respawns now. But the Uber is almost ready for IDK. They've got their soldiers peeking in already. Um, and nice kill there on the Sticky Trap by QNX. But there's already a soldier out here. It is Azured. And he probably needs to jump up here very quickly. Oh, he's going to give up some high ground advantage. The Uber's ready to go, but I think I would have liked to see our blue team jumping up on that right-hand side. They really could have gotten a lot of spam, and now they're getting that spam in on the red team. Good kill on the Medic. Popped him up in the air, and there was nothing he could do. Uh, Helberg trying to deal some damage to the Scout, who is doing his very best to get away from this. And he did get a kill there. That was going to be Rudy getting the kill on Azured right before uh, Helberg finished him off with the pistol. But Team Effort now has three players up once again. Good Sticky Trap. Another one there. IDK's got to watch out for this because QNX is dropping Sticky Traps all over the place. There you go. Beastie finally realizes that, hey, there's going to be a Sticky Trap here. And now Mad's just po poking straight in. He's not worried about Stickies at all or Spam or whatever. Finally drops back there after eating just one too many rockets for his liking. And Team Effort is now backed onto their second point. It is still one to three. So I do believe that IDK 
can bring this game back. What is it, like 10 and a half minutes left? That is more than enough time here on CP Granary to get quite a few points. So let's see whether our team here, IDK Denmark in Division 2, can bring it back to at least a tie game and bring it to a, a, some sort of an overtime round. A uh, good sticky trap there, but it is actually kind of a common location. And now a soldier jumping straight into the enemy team. Team effort does not have... <coughs> oh man, losing my voice. Team effort does not have a lot to answer to this, but they did drop back. They have a lot of space here on the last point, so they should be okay. Already a back cap going on, though, on that last point. BC is taken down. But Rudy here doing a good job defending. It's just there's only two players left up, and they do pop the Uber just trying to buy time here. They do get uh, one soldier spawning, and they should get another scout spawning as well. But I don't think it's going to be enough. There you go. Right now, we should have some stickies on the point. We don't, but there you go. That is the cap, nonetheless. <laughs> Crit Needles there after the round was over from Meek, so he manages to get a kill there. Not really during regular play, but it still counts. You know, we medics will take anything we can get. Um, yeah, team effort, though, kind of squandering their lead here a little bit, and so IDK finally seems to have found their sea legs. So I'm wondering whether we're going to see our Danes on the IDK Denmark team pushing back and winning another mid-fight, because that seems to have been what they really have needed most of the time. When they win these mid-fights, they do pretty well. Most of the time. I mean, there have been mid-fights where they've won and then they lost the round. I, I don't know. Um, good jump in there by the soldier. He's going to chase down that medic immediately and probably end up getting the kill. But Gompi, meanwhile... I'm sorry. It does watch Azured get taken out there by Johnny Jackal. First kill of the match. Uh, I'm sorry, of the fight here, anyway, of the round. There we go. And so now, some good damage coming in to Team Effort. Mads getting on top of him once again. Probably going to get this medic kill. Oh, he's just got to get one more sticky on him, and oh, can't quite get it. Uh, looks like our medic there, 95% uber for Team Effort. That is Brass Monkey, and he is at now at 100%, but is so low health. I, I really think um, if IDK had just gotten one more person in there to take him out, it would not have been hard, but it was uh, it was going to be tough for them. S is that really a spy being run right now? No, he's just waiting to uh, change spawn, so no problem here. And QNX trying to... S wait, they, they didn't even have the middle point. You can't spawn camp them. <laughs> good, good effort, though, from Team Effort. QNX trying to spawn camp, although didn't realize that that was not actually going to be their forward spawn. So now QNX is starting to take some pill stamp bam here. He's got to be really careful about this. The Uber is popped to take out Azured, who is jumping in and trying to kill one of Team Effort. Um, now Meek here has an advantage, and yeah, Effort cannot push out with this. The Uber is already over. So they're just going to have to sit back here and wait. And they're going to have to hope that IDK doesn't push with this Uber, because if they do, uh, Effort's going to be in trouble. They may want to leave somebody to try to get a back cap or something, but yeah, that's that's going to be risky too, because if they just leave one person behind from IDK, they could take a lot out. So Effort's going to be in a weird position. And actually, <laughs> speaking of a weird position, they're all hanging out in the Z right now, a.k.a. the lunchbox. I don't know why it's called that, but there you go. Uh, and they've already lost Rudy. There goes Daniel as well, who was going for that back app, but it's not going to happen at all. 100% Uber here for IDK. They've pushed forward onto the point. They've lost both of their scouts as well, but the Demo Man now down for Team Effort. And one soldier coming in and trying to get the kill, but Gompy goes down. So IDK now pushing forward to that middle point once again, where they were in such a clutch position. They were very, very close to losing this round. Now they could actually bring it back and win it. We will see. Uh, what is Dusty looking for here? Just trying to find people who are ambushing, I guess, looking for sticky traps, so good effort from him now, and now team effort, I mean, they do have their 100% Uber, but then both Ubers are popped, uh, it's just, I think that Reds was popped a lot later, IDK's gonna have to scramble to get out of here for a little while, you know, but here comes the soldier on top of the medic, trying to go for that kill, he's taken down, yeah, Helberg and BC, the only ones left for IDK, and they need to get out of there, this is not good for them at all, Helberg gonna run all the way back to the last point, he may even change out to Sniper again, or something, because I, it's it's just, uh, at this point, yeah, there you go. They need everything they can get. Team Effort is going to capture that second point. They're going to have a big uber advantage, so Helberg just getting ready to snipe anybody who walks out. Um, tough to see over that little ledge there, so really he's just going to be looking up at the, uh, at the high ground there. Inside the window here on CP Granary, there is a soldier who I thought may have gone out there, but no, actually, Scout pushing really far forward. Interesting. Uh, team effort, what are you doing? Right now they're hanging out at the lunchbox. This is a good place to hang, actually. Uh, if you know that the enemy is going to be coming into you, as long as you have some eyes on those doors and eyes on the high ground, you keep your medic way back there. He's going to be in good cover. He can get out whenever he needs to. Now that he's charged, they can think about pushing forward here. But look at this. Meek is almost up to 90%. Is he running the Kritzkrieg? No, he's running the regular Uber. 
Oh, nice kill on QNX. The Uber is actually popped in anyway. I don't, I'm not sure if it's a good decision by team effort. They do manage to get one kill on Azure Red, but the Uber's ready to go for IDK, and there you go. They finally pop it on that scout who just got way into Meek's face, but it could be too late. Scout taking a lot of hits right now. He does get taken out by Mads. The sticky's all over the place, right-clicking and left-clicking like a boss, but team effort do still have five players up here. Well, maybe four now. Daniel got caught on the, on the little railing there inside the base. That was kind of cute. So yeah, now IDK is actually pushing forward. No Uber for them, but they've got a two-player advantage. And there goes the Demo Man as well. They've got to be careful. There is a soldier up here and a soldier in the lunchbox, but the soldier upstairs looks like he's down, actually, or at the very least has taken a lot of damage. No, Gompy could end up getting some good flanking in here. They've got to be really careful that they don't lose a lot of players here for either team because this is a very tenuous moment right now. Where was that scout? I don't even know. I thought I saw somebody in behind, but maybe not. Sounds like, actually, uh, it has QNX and who was that? That was uh, Rudy have both died here so idk is actually thinking about pushing through these chokes and they're gonna do it um i don't know it looks like effort really cannot put anything together right now they may have dropped all the way back through their yeah um they've dropped all the way back into their yard for the most part no the uber is just now in johnny jackal uh is looking for some kills over here behind the enemy team he does manage to spot this scout gets that kill but now he's at 27 health he's got to be really careful here uh i don't see any way for him to deal any more damage but he has gotten back towards his medic there now he can actually he may even be at crit heal range, so we will see if he can't get that heal up really quickly. Looks like he probably will, but no, he has to drop back now. And actually, oh, look at this beautiful back cap. Uh, it is by a soldier medic combo. They're just going to have to watch out. They're going to have uh, enemies coming in at them through the lunchbox, and oh, that's not good at all. Lose a soldier there. Azured was not watching, and now, oh, they're completely surrounded. So these back cap attempts here, once again, not really paying off for IDK at all. Scout on top of the demo does take him out, and so Rudy looking just to clean up the rest of this team. Uh, can BC get any kills here or finish off the back cap? Actually, he may get the medic. Oh, that's the, one of the problems with not running the needles is that if you can't get your team to defend you and a scout gets on top of you, there's just nothing you can do. Of course, usually with the needles, nothing you can do anyway, but oh, BC finally taken out there. He had low health forever. What? Air shot with the crossbow. So Brass Monkey showing off some skills there with that, uh, that crossbow. Did get that really nice heal on the soldier to bring him back up to full health. He's got the charge now as well. Meek has... 35%. So it's still a 2-3 to three game here with only 3 minutes left to go. There's not enough time for anything more than like 3 or 4 Ubers. Uh, we do see Red popping theirs right now, trying to push forward and gain as much ground as they can because they don't want IDK to have any more chances to tie this up. Uh, good attempt at a sticky trap there, but it's going to be too late for Mads. He has to drop back down there. Oh, he's going to get surrounded. Did manage to finish off Johnny Jackal right before he died with a pill. Uh, but IDK do hold on to the middle point for now. They've got a scout on the medic, though. Oh, they do manage to save Meek just for the moment. He took a lot of damage. He's at 90%. He really needs to get that Uber up, and he needs to grab this health kit, but it hasn't spawned yet. There you go. It's finally spawned for him. So now he's ready to push forward with his team. IDK is feeling the time crunch, but look at team effort. Only three players left alive. Uh, they are dropping back into their... Um, into their second point and those stickies oh they're still there they gotta be careful oh it was so close to being a sticky trap kill and it was just detonated at the wrong time uh, now the uber has been popped but there goes helberg did not keep enough of that uber to stop himself from walking over those stickies and dying there oh soldier coming in as well trying to get some kills gompy was the only one who died and oh idk what are you doing they're pushing in one at a time here now it's just medic and demo They've still got enough players to, I think, hold on to the second point, but look at this. They're getting spammed in, and team effort here knows. They smell blood in the water. They are immediately pushing on to the second point. Even if they're going to get flanked a little bit, they're going to be okay to hold on to the second for now. They've got the Uber. They knew they could pop it whenever they needed. Um, a, a good attempt at spam there. Here comes the Uber actually very, very early for our red team, and, and they're trying to take out all these players at their flanks. Looks like finally Mads dies. Mads was way out of position there. Not sure what he was going for. Um, Scout tries to get a little bit of a back cap, and now Dusty dealing some rocket damage, but you know runs out of rockets, has to reload. Uh, and team effort here. Uh, they're going to have to drop back away from this Uber if they can force it. If they can force the Uber from Meek. Uh, yeah, they do that right now, actually then they should be okay to defend. Um, they're getting a couple kills here. Gompy is down. Where is that demo? I don't know. And actually, I don't think IDK really knows either at this point. It's chaos all over right now. IDK, oh, they're getting spammed in. Okay, demo did manage to retreat. They're getting spammed in here. They need to get this capture. And, oh, QNX is taken out. Looks like our scout here is managing... Oh, does manage to kill that... Uh, uh, I'm sorry, soldier. 
It's now Medic on top of his scouts here, just trying to get these heals, and they need to push in because it looks like Team Effort, if they can hold on for just a few more seconds here, another minute, in fact, they will win this. They've got a heavy up right now. It's going to be really tough to push into. They've almost got their Uber as well. So uh, Medic down to about 50 health, and he has to drop back into the uh, resupply cabinet just to heal back up and be ready to go. He's almost got his Uber ready now. Um, yeah, so no off-passing here for Mighty K either. They don't have a sniper. They don't have anything. They're just... This is going to be the last push. Uh, 30 seconds left to go. They've got 80% Uber. They're going to wait for the Uber to get back up. They need to build it as quickly as possible. And they're already starting to push. Uh, here it goes. There, uh, Helberg is taken out by a sticky trap right away. Uh, Uber is popped on the heavy, and now I think as long as they hold onto the Uber on the point, they should be okay. Need to get some stickies on that point from our demo man there from Blue Team very quickly if they want to have a chance to get this done. But looks like the stickies were all finished off for him, and there you go. IDK is going to fail this push, and that means that Team Effort win this game. That was a very close one indeed on CP Granary, and we are going to go on to a second map, CP Obscure Remake. So do tune in and make sure you hit follow. Tell your friends to check this channel out as well, youtube.com slash fatmop, where you'll find all of your competitive TF2 shoutcasting needs. See you guys later.